All right, Dinwiddie and I were on a new spot. I found this foundation yesterday. Hopefully it's never been dug. Not convinced this is the house. This might be the outbuilding, so. Anyways, let's see what we can get. My first good find. You know what? That's neat. That's a fancy suspender buckle. Let me uh, clean it up just a little bit. That thing's beautiful. I'm pretty sure it says security brand. That's neat. So Dinwiddie just dug this one. It looks like part of a suspender. And it says solid silver front. So this might be a silver piece right there. Yeah. So that had me going there for a second. I thought that was going to be a coin. <laughs> I saw the round thing. It's a Levi Strauss uh, suspender button. Man, you never get those. Ain't much. D. It's a D. Yeah, we're just really not sure if this is the outbuilding or if it's been hit. Yeah. Just not as much here as we'd hoped. But it ain't over yet. Yep. Yeah. Well, I got a garter clip, and I even got the the little piece that slides. You never get that thing with it. It would have fallen out almost always. Not bad. Dang. All of a sudden, I'm starting to get some personal items. There's another little piece to probably suspend or something. Oh, whoever dug this the first time, they didn't get everything, did they? There's a cones boss. Well, where there's one, there's almost always two, or three or four. Well, I got a handsaw medallion. Let's see. I think I've got this one before. I wish I could read it for you guys, but... Something and Sons... Balada... And I didn't even grab my camera. I just saw this big boulder and I thought, well, you know, people hang around stuff like this. And I get a 13 right at the base. I don't know what it is for sure, but I know it's a nickel. At least it looks like a nickel. Oh. You know what? I think that's going to be a V nickel. Let me clean it up. We'll get a date. So it's a little slick, but in good shape. Anyways, the date on it's 1889. Man, I just had a, I don't know, I guess a premonition. <laughs> it's just like, I even almost kept going. I thought, no, it'll only take a minute. Just swing over by the rock. In fact, I haven't even finished swinging. Maybe there's something else. Man, I made my, that saved my day right there. Yeah, that other side, it's just been hammered so hard. There's just hardly anything there. It's beautiful, but dang, that's so cool. Man, I just get a kick out of this hobby. That's so funny. <laughs> There's like, I think I got 122 shell over there besides the V-nickel. There's nothing over there. I guess somebody in the, Late 1800s, just took a nap right there and fell out of his pocket or something. But yeah, when you see something like that, you know people probably congregate there. Just give it a shot. Now well, it doesn't make sense, but man, you never know. Nice. So I'm here with my fabulous wife and Gunner. We are not metal detecting right now. We are just scouting because I did some research and I thought that there might be a cabin up here and we can see it. We're not to it yet. It looks amazing from here. I can't for the life of me figure out why anybody's here though. So I'm probably gonna metal detect it um, later in the episode. Right now we're just gonna check out the cabin, see if we can find any bottles or anything. Should be fun. Well, there's the first look. 
My wife's flipping out. <laughs> we'll give you a bunch of different looks. This thing's really cool. Middle of the mountains of Montana. She's going in. Bears or no bears. Look how tall I look to this window, to this door. The crazy thing is, yeah, this is definitely, the logs all have chinking and everything, so. I need a point. Yeah, I'm not sure what kind of cabin this is or what the point of it was. I doubt it's grazing. Might be mining, I guess. Hunting camp, I don't know. Well, I think it's becoming clear what this place was. I think it was a mine. Look at that hole. That hole's probably 20 feet deep. Stove door. Yeah, that's a nice handle. Look at that. I mean, it's rusted, but isn't it pretty? So pretty. Good eye, sweetheart. I thought they were cats from a distance. <laughs> Okay, so I'm back to the cabin my wife and I found yesterday. I already found uh, two clad coins, unfortunately. <laughs> Here's my first old thing, alarm clock. So we got a noob here. He got himself a little brass buckle though. Look at that. Nice. There's my first button. The backside's blown out, a little two-piece, but it says engineer coat. Never got that one before. All right, we've been struggling a little bit here at this site to get some good stuff. But hey, there's a garter clip. Nice. It's a little better sign. Well, I got some sort of coin. <laughs> it's just a dime. Clad dime. Well, this has been kind of a battle, to be honest. There's a lot of uh, newer stuff. People have been partying here. And I think someone's detected it before. But here's part of a suspender. It says Wilson Brothers. Never seen that one before. That'll be a fun one to look up. And try and figure out how old it is. Look at, look at that awesome treasure. What do you think, bud? You like that one? Mm -hmm. Well, I wish that uh, cabin was better than it ended up being. The only thing has been detected before. But usually when they're still standing, it's pretty obvious and easier for other detectors to find them. So anyways, hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. <laughs>